Have you watched uh, Chernobyl yet? I have not watched all of it, but in, by because of your recommendations, <laughs> I have watched some of it. OK, well, if you, if you have watched it, um, about the nuclear power plant disaster in Ukraine, you'll know that um, one of the more haunting episodes was about uh, looking at how hundreds of pets in the area were culled by the Soviet military. Now, some of them managed to evade their hunters, and now their descendants are being offered medical care. Volunteers are humanely trapping strays within the exclusion zone, uh, washing them, vaccinating them, sterilising them, and most are released back into the wild, but some of the younger pups are then being taken in as pets. Wow, what a story. Yeah. There you go. And, yes, I have, I have started watching it because of you. There's all sorts of... There's the, I think the best bit of it is right at the end where they just run you through all the statistics. I won't ru ru ruin it for you or for anyone else who hasn't seen it yet, but the stuff like... What they still claim is the official death toll. Right, compared is, to yeah, what, what it might what it be. Might have been, yeah. If we say it might, because nobody actually knows, Exactly, there's a huge range of what it could possibly be and still is affecting generations of people as well.